Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the Grinchmas Hula Day Spectacular. Dr. Seuss released his original story over 50 years ago, and in celebration of that anniversary, we present to you this new retelling of his Hula Day classic. As an added Christmas gift, the show features classic songs arranged by Chip Davis and Mannheim Steamroller. The holidays are about sharing with others, so we invite you to take plenty of photographs to share the memories with family and friends. Please refrain from using flash photography or any light source on your camera, as this will startle the Who's. And now, Universal Orlando invites you to open your heart and enjoy the Grinchmas Hula Day Spectacular! St. Nicholas soon would be there. Merry Christmas! Not yet! Okay. All right, everybody. Christmas Day is almost here. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my. This tree is not up to our festive standard. Where's Martha? Where's Martha? <gasps> Working through the night and all through the day was the decorating committee, led by the lovely Martha May.
Christmas a lot. That's true. Wahoo! A bingo bells, a bingo bells, something, something at my house. Huh. <laughs> but the Grinch, who lived just north of Whoville, did not. Noise, 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 noise. Curse that Christmas music. It's joyful and triumphant. The Grinch hated Christmas, the whole Christmas season. Now please don't ask why, no one quite knows the reason. It could be that his head wasn't screwed on quite right. It could be, perhaps, that his shoes were too tight. Ow. But I think the most likely reason of all may have been that his heart was two sizes too small. Bah, who bark, exclaimed the Grinch, staring down from his cave with a sour, grinchy frown at the warm light of windows below in their town. For he knew every who down in Whoville beneath was busy now, hanging a mistletoe wreath. And they're hanging their stockings. The Grinch snarled with a sneer. <gasps> Tomorrow's Christmas. It's practically here. Then he growled with his green Grinch fingers nervously drumming. I must find some way to keep Christmas from coming. But how?
got an idea. An awful idea. The Grinch got a wonderful, awful idea. I know just what to do. Come on, Max! <laughs> the Grinch laughed in his throat, and he made a quick Santa Claus hat and a coat, and he chuckled and cried, What a great Grinchy trick! With this coat and this hat, I'll look just like Saint Nick! <gasps> I'm speaking in rhymes. Blast! <laughs> filled the air. All the hooves were all dreaming, sweet dreams without care. Merry Christmas! Ah, uh, you're having a bad dream. Go back to sleep. Okay. okay. Sucker. <laughs> when he came to the first house in the square, Ooh, this is top number one, the old Grinchy Claus hissed. Then he climbed to the roof, empty bags in his fist. The roof? I don't think so. What's next? Then he slid down the chimney, a rather tight pinch. Nope. Can you skip ahead? But if Santa could do it, then so could the Grinch. Well, if Santa could do it, then so could the Grinch. Then he slithered and slunk with a smile most unpleasant. Now that... I can do. <laughs> Around the whole room, and he took every present. He took their singing bowls, tringlers, and puzzles. He took their pantuglers, tazzlers, and muzzles. He cleaned out that ice box as quick as a flash. Why, that Grinch even took their last can of hoot hash. <laughs> then he stuffed all the presents up the chimney with glee. And now, grrr, the Grinch, I will stuff up the tree. Pushing your luck, pal. So the Grinch grabbed a tree and he started to shove when he heard a small sound, like the coo of a dove. He turned around fast and he saw a small who, little Cindy Lou who. Santa Claus! Cuckoo! Why? Why are you taking our Christmas tree? Why? Awkward. But you know, that old Grinch was so smart and so slick, he thought up a lie, and he thought it up quick. <coughs> Why, my sweet little tot, the fake Santa Claus lied. You're not helping. <coughs> There's a light on this tree. It won't light on one side. So I'm taking it home to my workshop, my dear. I'll fix it up there, and then bring it back here. 
I'm rhyming again. Santa Claus? What? Don't forget about the Grinch. Got the Grinch. I know he hates Christmas, and he's green with bad breath and smelly feet with shoes that are two sizes too small. Ow. But just because he's different, that doesn't mean he shouldn't get a present on Christmas. Good night. You kid. Bad judge of character. You're a vile one. He was graciously humming. They're finding out now that no Christmas is coming. They're just waking up. I know just what they'll do. Their mouths will hang open for a minute or two. Then all the Who's down in Whoville will all cry. Boo hoo. <laughs> now that's a noise, grinned the Grinch. I simply must hear. So he paused. And the Grinch put a hand to his ear. But he did hear a sound rising over the snow. It started in low, then it started to grow. But the sound wasn't sad. Why, this sound sounded merry. It couldn't be so. But it was merry. Very. Down in Whoville, the tall and the small was singing without any presents at all. He hadn't stopped Christmas from coming. It came. Somehow or other, it came just the same. And the Grinch, with his Grinch feet ice cold in the snow, stood puzzling and puzzling. How could it be so? It came without ribbons. It came without tags. It came without packages, boxes, or bags. And he puzzled and puzzled till his puzzler was sore. Then the Grinch thought of something he hadn't before. Maybe Christmas, he thought, doesn't come from a store. Maybe Christmas, perhaps, means a little bit more. And what happened then? Well, in Whoville, they say, that the Grinch's small heart grew three sizes that day. <gasps> Max! And now that his heart didn't feel quite so tight, he wins with his load to the bright morning light. With a smile in his soul, he descended from the trumpet, cheerfully blowing who sounds on his trumpet. I was just... All right. I took your sing giggles, your tringlers and puzzles. I took your pantuclers, your dazzlers, and your wuzzles. Not the wuzzles! I took all your Christmas presents, it's true. But because of this child's kindness, I bring it all back to you. I'm rhyming again. And I like it. I know, Harry. No. Greasy Oily does it. How embarrassing. No. It's warm. Merry Christmas.
Christmas in you. Merry Christmas, Mr. Grinch. Welcome Christmas. Bring your cheer. Cheer to all who's far and near. Christmas Day is in our grasp, as long as we have hands to clasp. Christmas Day will always be, just as long as we have we. <laughs> Welcome Christmas while we stand, heart to heart and hand to hand. for the Grinchmas Holiday Spectacular. At this time, we ask that you exit the theater so that we may prepare for our next show. Please make sure you have all of your items and take small children by the hand as you exit. Universal Orlando extends the warmest of seasonal wishes from our family to yours. Have a very Merry Christmas and the happiest of New Year's. <laughs>